when the STEM school was forming in 2010. We were there, showing how this 60,000 square foot office space in Highlands Ranch was being transformed into a school focused on science and technology. If we look at our competition around the world, we're really lagging behind as a nation. As time goes on, the school grows and scores academic success with outstanding students garnering national recognition. One tag, so you all can understand what a starting tag means. It is known for its use of technology to expand learning. The thing that we really want is it for it to be everywhere. But some say something changed at this charter school. STEM School Highlands Ranch is run by a separate board from Douglas County. But Douglas County Schools does hold the charter contract, allowing this separate public school to operate within the district. Earlier this year, when STEM applied for a five-year renewal of its charter, the Douglas County School Board only offered three years and made a list of required improvements, including an improved communications pathway for parents and students to lodge complaints. An online web petition cites several civil rights lawsuits filed against the STEM school while calling for the termination of STEM's current board president and executive director. Tuesday afternoon, the horrific shooting. As a separate charter school, STEM contracts a private company for security, Boss High Level Protection, and Grant Whitus. I wanted to take all the training that we've given to law enforcement officers over the last 20 years from Columbine, take the young military men and women that are getting out of, uh, out of the service, train them to that level, and offer them to schools to protect the children. Whitus says his security officer, a former Marine, helped detain one of the shooters before police arrived. The original founders of the STEM school, Judy and Barry Brandberg, released a statement which reads, quote, This school and its students, past and future, are like our own children. We are praying for all of the students of STEM, parents and staff.